rockin' with that chest, not Jeffers TV, cake ass. Now, Rich. Little Bill, showin' 20s on Pirelli skills. Got your muscles dilated like the mixed fields. No time to stop, focus only on the meal. Yeah, man, so boys is saying Big Meach then came to the highs, man. They say he at the halfway house. Um, yeah, man, shit, Big Meach, man. I remember Big Meach went to jail. They had to be about 2006, five. Big Meach did about 18, 19 years. But that boy at the halfway house. So I seen they said that he won't get out till 2000, well, his projected release date, 2026, February. I'm like, damn. But normally times, most of the time that you're going to stay at the halfway house is like six months to a year in the feds. But then you can get out early. You can get on home confinement where they just put you on the ankle monitor and then you just do the rest of your halfway house time or whatever at the house. So that's most likely what's going to happen to Big Meat. You know what I'm saying? But man, this here, uh, you know, it ain't too much to say about the situation, but he came home. He ain't said shit yet. But I remember one time, man, I had a little run-in with BML, Big Meech himself wasn't there. But it was J-Bo and Jeezy. Jeezy was there. There's a couple more BMF niggas who I don't know their name. But it was a Super Bowl down here in Houston. It was like um, 2005 or four or one of them years, man. But anyway, it was either the Super Bowl or the All-Star game. Because they was like both back-to-back -back years and shit that time. So, uh. Man, me, me and my boy uh, Dello, R.I.P. Dello, man, we go to Harlem Nights and shit. Well, we been going out around our whole town, man, because town is lit up. It ain't nothing but high, uh, 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 high-end foreign cars riding around everywhere, superstars everywhere, right? So we go to uh, we go to Honest, we couldn't get in, it's too packed. We go to all the different clubs, we couldn't get in. So we go, I go to my old little stomping ground in town, Harlem Nights, you know what I'm saying, over there in the north. So uh, my boy Big Boy at the time, his people, you know what I'm saying, they got their own Harlem night. So we couldn't get in there either. But I called Big Boy. Big Boy let us through the back door. You know what I'm saying? So man, listen, man, we go in the back door. When I tell you, I ain't never seen no shit like this before. Man, from the time we got in there to the time we left money just falling, hitting us all on top of the motherfucking head and the face. It done got to the point I done got aggravated with the shit. And then you got this group of niggas over here competing with these group of niggas. And this one up. So BMF niggas was like behind the stage and shit. So uh I ain't know they were there till I heard Jeezy voice on the on the fucking um on the on the microphone. And Jeezy, you know what I'm saying, he say he wanted a six pack of Chris. So at the time I know Chris style bottles in that motherfucker is like 300 pieces, something like that. So uh dude say, man, Jeezy, we ain't got number seven. And so he say, bring me all them hoes, right? So I'm like, damn, I look at Dello. I'm like, at the time, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I probably had about $2,000 in my pocket. So I'm like, yo, man, this nigga just spent our whole, my whole pocket on drinks. I'm like, my league, I'm figure the fuck out of here. I need to go back and hustle some more. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but the nigga J-Bo was in there. Man, I'm going to tell you, man, them niggas had money and wrapped up in plastic like this here, man. Look like they brought out the goddamn Brinks truck, man. But yeah, man, that's how them boys were doing it out there. Them BMF, man, them boys had money falling all over the goddamn place. You hear me? Made me go home, take my ass back to the block. I had to get back. That's one of the things that helped me go to the feds. Nigga trying to goddamn. Man, I seen them niggas eating like that, man. And person and I, I was like, I ain't hustling hard enough. I'm finna go home and get on the block. Fuck the All-Star game. <laughs> I'm finna go get this money, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But yo, man, y'all like the video, subscribe to the channel, man. Um, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate all my new subscribers, man. You know what I'm talking about, man. Uh, y'all get in the comments, man. Y'all know I like to go back and forth in the comments, man. What y'all think Big Meech gonna do? Y'all think y'all think Big Meech gonna, gonna go get into the, the mogul thing? You think he gonna get back into the business? You know what I'm saying? The entertainment? Or he just gonna keep it quiet? You know what I'm saying? That's what I want to know what y'all think. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I'm going to get back with y'all later, bro. Move slow. Think fast for shizzle.